Local business has managed to survive all of the obstacles of COVID-19 so far. The two sisters who own the ice cream shop bought it last year. But as News Edge reporter Portia Bruner tells us, their story begins way before that. Thriving in the midst of a COVID-19 pandemic, well, it's more than a notion for small business owners, but a pair of sisters who come from right here in DeKalb County have figured out how to do it two scoops at a time. Bumper to bumper traffic for ice cream. Well, that's the scene at Double Scoop Ice Cream Shop in Stonecrest this week after one customer with a big Twitter following spread the news about the new shop. We basically went viral, and so now we have a lot of support from our community. Janae Bucan and Yvonne Bazemar are the millennial sisters who opened Double Scoop Ice Cream in October 2019. Hello, how you doing? 13 years after they worked as teenagers here when it was a Brewster's ice cream shop. We were scoopers and now we're the owners, so that feels really good. We never could have imagined that it would be the same location with all the equipment. It looks exactly the same from when we worked here. These young entrepreneurs have learned a lot of lessons about thriving in business during tough economic times. Since they have more than ice cream on the menu, they were able to keep the drive through open by serving meals during the height of the coronavirus pandemic. And up until mid-June, the owners were the only scoopers which saved money on payroll. But now that it's summertime, we have increased the amount of our employees to help with drive through and the window. And persistence paid off as well. When the payroll protection loan they received didn't pay as much as they had hoped, they applied for a small business association grant and received $10,000. Well, so that just helped with hiring, supplies, expenses, utilities. But Janae says the biggest business lesson they've learned is the value of using resources wisely. Giving away a few scoops cuts into profits in the short term, but brings in more customers in the long term. And they serve up something new on social media every chance they get. So through our social media outlets, we've been able to communicate with our customers, and they have been coming through drive through and to the window to support us. In DeKalb County, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News.